Well, the, the journey from Mecca to Yasrib or Medina is absolutely fine and very comfortable these days. But just imagine, centuries ago, when these means of communication were not available, how tough the journey would be. The hard desert was terrible for any traveler, and particularly when they had to travel on the camels at that time. Short of food, short of water, hot weather, or very cold weather. Zat Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was too young at that time, and they stayed for complete one month in Medina Sharif. And after one month, once they came back en route, a very, very tragic incident occurred, which was absolutely unbearable. And if we imagine it from that viewpoint and the age of Zati Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. When they reached a village named Abwar, which is 23 miles away from Hajwa, she was not well and ultimately she passed away. This was a big shock to Zati Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. She was buried at the same place and Prophet's age was just six years. Now first, if you see the tragedies or the problems through which our Prophet, peace be upon him, the biggest personality of the universe had to undergo lot many tests and lot many problems. He was born orphan. And after that, he lost his mother also after six years of age, which is the age to play, to enjoy, to run around, to roam around. Ye ek aisa dukha me islam hatha ki ye zate rasool sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam ki zat hi jaan sakti hai. Ab sawal ye tha ki itne chote bachche ko itna faasla tay kar ke wapas makka kaise le jaya jaye aur kahan le jaya jaye. Well, dear viewers, these questions seem very simple and not very hard, but they are very hard questions. Fortunately, a female nurse, Umme Amun, Riziyallahu ta'ala anha, she embraced Islam afterwards. She was also accompanying the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam and Hazrat Amina. As I said, he was just six years old and this nice lady was his nurse. She used to look after him. To come back to Medina, they had no other company except Umme Amun radiyallahu ta'ala anha who brought the Prophet peace be upon him sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam back to Mecca and whatever she could do possibly she did it.